Chicago to start out. Right side, Jordan. Pass to Macy. Back to Jordan. Shot clock at six. Connects on the 17 foot. Johnson outside. That's good, Jordan. Oakley inside. Parrish is there. And Green slams it in. You know, for a guy his size, he doesn't play above the rim very often like he did on that slam. So it's Boston now after the Bulls pick up two. A shot's good. The dish to McHale. Right through the deep. And Masics to Gervin. Outside Jordan. From beyond the arc. That's good. McHale outside. Here's Johnson. And he gets it to go. Like he was going for a piggyback ride. Bird against Gervin. Bird's shot is... Oakley inside, defended by Parrish. Shots good by Oakley's quarter of action, just under three and a half minutes played. It's stolen by Green. Michael Jordan on the wing. And that one goes in as he is fouled. It'll be three points if he converts at the line. Well, there's no better shot creator in the history of the game than Michael Jordan. He typically still got the shot to drop. Now here's McHale. And there are the Celtics. Sometimes to a fault. And that showed right there. That's a bad shot. Exactly. I mean, that's self-inflicted damage right there. They're a lot better off in this opening half part. Now here's Gervin. He's been patient so far. Nothing yet on the score. Keeping the ball inside and getting points from close range right at the rim. And I would continue to do it in a force around. Shot clock at six. Here's Gervin. And the Bulls tack on two. On the wing, Burke shoots from the baseline, and he gets it to go. Jordan with it, now defended by Bill Walton. A nice shot by Jordan. And here we go, the Bulls' fast break. And he caps off the fast break with a monster slam. Textbook example there of how to use defense to create a it's far too tentative in the paint and even more so when the defender is up tight on him like that time close game as we wrap up the second quarter in chicago they lead by a bucket we'll take a quick break then get you back to the action now presented by sprint and it's halftime on 2K Sports. Keep it right here as we break down the first half. The Bulls are in a close one against the Boston Celtics. They've done a great job closing out their defensive possessions, grabbing boards, great rebounding. A productive first half for the Iceman, George Gervin. He's chipped in four points, and he's had some good court vision, helping out in the assist department as well. Looking at Boston, they're definitely making plays as well. Excellent bench production. The second string coming in, knocking down the shots. Kevin McHale getting it done through two. He's chipped in four points, and he's been able to provide some nice assists as well. And that's all there is for me here in the studio. Time to send you back to my friend Kevin Harlan and the crew for the second half. The Sprint Halftime Report. Left side, Jordan. From the arc. And he gets it to go. Johnson outside. On the wing, Bird. Basket is good, the assistant. Oh, no. 
know who they're up against. Probably a good time to make some changes with a good chunk of the second half still to go, Kevin. And as always, Doris, thank you. He is an automatic finisher when he gets into that area. You know, he fixed the simple one-handed stuff to get the two points. And those could be an important winner on the day as well. Yeah, a lot of times, he's one of those players who can get. There's the pass to Macy. Here's Green. Second chance shot. Uses the glass to 13 points in the game. Kicks it to Gervin. It's stolen by Mikhail. To the middle. Here's Ainge. Rebound by the Bulls. Macy's got three rebounds now in this one. Here's Gervin. And it's good as his. They got to get going. Now here's Johnson. Bird with it. Now guarded by Gervin. And he gets it to get enough there. He made it a two possession game, at least. And that one's good. Outside Jordan. Banked in off the glass. The feet to Walton. Shoots it up. He hits the back iron and knocks it loose. Curvin. And it's Chicago's. He kicks to Parrish. Again, the Celtics need that point guard skills that can play both those positions. Yeah, for sure. Okay, now let's reset our lineups courtesy of Gatorade. All fueled up and ready to go for this fourth quarter. Just five to shoot. And Macy kicks to Jordan. Bullseye! And another shot. Dishes to Parrish. And that one's good. Dishes it to McHale. That's in. Coming off the assist. You hate to lose Oof, it. Boy, after all this, this energy that both teams have expended, uh, yet you're right, Clark. This would be a tough one to lose. Here's Bird. Bird nails it and will go to the line for a chance at one more. Let's look at the energy stats, how the hustle game has been going for the Celtics. There. Left side, Jordan. Fades. That's good. Jordan against Parrish. Jordan, the pass to Macy. That drops and it comes off and it's thanks a lot, Doris. A kill with it. He's picked up by Jordan to end the run. It's in! And the drive by Jordan. That's good. Well, Jordan has been fantastic. There's 42 seconds left in the fourth quarter. Here's Johnson. Nails it! Down and he came away with it. McHale upside. It's good. This game is good against Gervin. Outside Jordan. Jordan off a pit from Green. And Macy kicks to Jordan. You gotta love the use of the bounce pass there. Perfect feed. Time call here. The Celtics just could shoot a three here and go for the win. But I'd expect them to try to send it to overtime. The defenders don't want to foul in this situation. So you should be able to get a shot off inside. And so the big win by Chicago in a tight game. Well, they don't get much more exciting than that, Clark. They sure don't. And when it was gut check time, this team kept their composure, kept their emotions in check, and got it done. Thanks for tuning in to the NBA on 2K Sports.